Okay, y'all, so today we're gonna place our antibiotic sensitivity discs onto our agar culture. So we have our culture plates that have grown, our bacillus that you guys already discovered. And now the next step of the antibiotic sensitivity testing is to place one from each of these vials onto our plates. So what we're gonna do um, first, um, we'll read through, we have tetracycline in this one. We have streptomycin here. We also have neomycin, erythromycin, and penicillin. So you can see these little containers are full of these tiny little paper discs. And each of these paper discs are impregnated with that antibiotic. So we're gonna place them onto the cassettes um, in just different areas across the agar. And then uh, we'll be able to come back and measure our zone of inhibition to see which of these five antibiotics is going to kill the bacillus the best. Um, so these little uh, vials do come with a fancy little kind of uh, clicker applicator, but these can be kind of tricky to use. So today what I'll be doing is just using a pair of thumb forceps to help get my plate um, or my paper off and onto my plate. So let's go ahead and do this one first. Um, so I'm going to get my container ready. I'm going to go ahead and get one of my pieces of paper. Um, they're just these little paper discs. Once I can pull one off, I'll show you guys kind of what they look like. They're very thin. This one's kind of being a pickle. There we go. So there's our paper disc for the penicillin. So we're just gonna open our plate and drop it on. And you can kind of tamp it down just to make sure it actually does make contact with your sample. So I'll go ahead and do that with all of my other antibiotic discs um, until I have one kind of spread across these different portions of the plate. And that's how you do your antibiotic sensitivity disc placement.